Hey, Psych2Goers. Have you ever had a hunch that your crush felt the same way you did about them? If you don't feel like asking them out to find out, you really should give it a try. Then here are six signs that someone secretly finds you attractive. Ooh la la. Number one, they make subtle gestures to fix their appearance. So you're chatting away with someone when you notice they fix their hair in between pauses in the conversation, or maybe they hide away to reapply their chapstick when you hang out. Generally, if someone likes you, they'll wanna look their best. This is especially true if they only make these subtle fixes when they think you're looking away. They may not want to let on that they like you, so they'll try to readjust themselves when you turn away. Number two, they randomly say they're single. Have you ever been talking to someone casually when you notice they randomly place the fact that they're single into your conversation? Perhaps they said it quite bluntly and out of place, which should be a clear sign. Or maybe it was more subtle, but there may have been a look of calculation or nervousness behind their eyes. This is a good thing. It can be a sign that they very well do like you. They could be trying to hint that you should ask them out. Psst, take a hint. Number three, their voice changes. You were walking down the hall when you heard them talking to their friend casually. Then suddenly when you say hi and begin a conversation, their voice changes. You know what they normally sound like, yet when talking to you, their voice simply sounds different. Many have noted that sometimes people change their voice subconsciously or even consciously when speaking to someone they find attractive. Some men may lower their voices, while some women may raise the pitch of their voices. They want to stand out to you and so they may try to present you with their most pleasant speaking voices. Number four, they tease you. Does your crush tease you? This could be their way of flirting. Teasing is a common style of flirting. They may make some lighthearted jokes or make some silly comments. As long as what they're saying isn't hurtful or rude, a bit of teasing with some smiles and good eye contact is likely a sign they're into you. Number five, their body leans towards you. Have you ever been in a group conversation when you notice someone is leaning more towards you than anyone else in the group? They may be subconsciously leaning more towards you than the others, either because they are comfortable around you or want to talk to you more. According to psychologist Jack Schaefer, people lean towards people they like and distance themselves from people they dislike. Inward leaning increases as rapport increases. So you may turn your head towards someone first, then your shoulders, followed by your torso. Then if you're really interested in what someone has to say, you'll lean towards them. So do you notice your crush leaning towards you when seated together? They may just really like you. They're likely deeply interested in what you have to say and who you are. So get talking and hint you like them too. And number six, they act nervous around you. When you find someone attractive, do you often get nervous? Or maybe you're at a loss for words in awe over how good looking they are. Well, lots of people act nervous around the ones they like. Have you noticed your crush's palms are sweaty around you or that they can't stop tripping over their words? Hint, hint, maybe they just like you. They may even act awkward around you simply because you make them feel special. Uh-oh, butterflies again. So have you noticed these signs in someone? Is it your crush by chance? If you like them back, go ahead and hint that you feel the same way. Then asking if they'd wanna go out on a date may be a great next step. We gotta get these butterflies to settle down some way. Maybe if you got to know them better, they at least won't flutter around so fast. We hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, don't forget to click the like button, comment, and share it with a friend. Subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell icon for more content like this. And as always, thanks for watching.